becoming mortgage free in seven years. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and I hope you are doing well. If you're joining me on my channel for the very first time, my name is Mujisa Laubazwaye and on my channel, I share career videos, life-changing motivation and real life practical tips that will help you to maximize your potential as an individual. If you like those kind of content, please do click the subscribe button and stay connected with me on my channel. Today, I want to share with you my plan on being mortgage free in about seven years. If you look around on YouTube, you will see a lot of expert teaching on this. I'm telling you, you do not have to be a financial guru or expert to achieve this milestone. Let me start from the beginning. And if you've not watched the video of our home that I shared with you here on my YouTube, click somewhere here. You see the video of the home. I shared that very transparently just to inspire people and to encourage people. We've lived here in this home now for one year. If you checked out, out that video, you'll notice that I actually shared it about one year ago. It was December slash January 2022-2023 that I shared it, right? So we actually have the plan or the focus to finish paying for this house in seven years. We're actually on track to be able to achieve that milestone, which is really important for us. Uh, it's a personal vision and goal that we have for our own lives. We've been able to fast track 19 years lifespan of mortgage to 15 years and three months in one year, right? It takes a lot of discipline, it takes a lot of focus, and it takes a lot of strategy. And of course, it takes a lot of budgeting. Budgeting is the key word. Knowing where my money is going at every point in time, knowing where our family income is going at every point in time. Every penny is accounted for. So I'm in my mid forties and my husband is in his early fifties, which also goes to show that it's not too late or it's never too late for you to achieve a milestone like this, if this is what you want. And this is why I wanted to share this video to encourage you, my viewers who have asked questions when I first shared that video. So this mortgage is planned to complete in 19 years, but based on some of the research I have personally done. In fact, this notepad here, I actually opened it for a home, the repayment, uh, the research I did before the purchase and everything surrounding it. At some stage, I'll come here and share my spreadsheet with you. I was tracking and tracing every expenses I was incurring in setting up this home, in doing it, everything I'm accounting for because it's important for me to be able to know where my money goes to. I never used to be like that, but I am like that now. So I'm very, very keen on knowing where my money is. Back to the mortgage repayments. This, the mortgage is scheduled to, to be completed in 19 years, but we are hoping and trusting God to finish paying it in seven years. It's gonna take a lot of discipline, a lot of focus, and a lot of strategy as well. Of course, with the help of God. For our home is about 550,000 euros, just to sum it up. So this would have covered the actual purchase of the home, uh, the price we paid for also, uh, the solicitor, uh, the, the taxes we paid to the government, and everything surrounding it. Investment was about 550,000 euros. It's a big purchase for us, but it's very well deserved because we needed an upgrade and, and to accommodate our lifestyle. The repayment for the home is about 2,400. This has a lot to do with my age and my husband's age. I'll repeat again, I'm in my mid 40s and my husband is in his early 50s. So the mortgage wasn't for 25 years or 30 years, it's basically for 19 years. In fact, some banks were actually willing 
to only give us about 15 years again because of our age. We didn't borrow a lot of money. I will make a video on how we were able to save up actually to be able to deposit a huge chunk of money out of this home. So we paid about 150,000 uh, in cash to the bank and we took the rest in mortgage. Someone will say 150, that's a lot. Here in the Republic of Ireland with 150,000 euros, you can actually buy your home in cash. If you go to areas like Longford, Edgeworth Town, far places, you can actually use that money to buy in cash. We were looking at a whole lot of things, branding our lifestyle, especially our children, and we, we couldn't remove them from where we were before to go to those kind of far places and buy the house in cash and be mortgage free. That would have been really nice. We're not ready for that. One child in middle school or secondary school, the other one was preparing uh, for university. So it was important for us to live centrally and for them to be able to assess home, assess transportation. That was very uh, important in our decision making. So I'm finally in the process of doing my research I realized that if we paid additional 10% more on our mortgage every month, we will fast track the repayment of our mortgage. Firstly, we've spent one year in this home. Uh, the mortgage lifespan is supposed to be 19 years. So let's deduct one year we spend in this home and, I've, and we've paid the mortgage. So we've reduced the mortgage to 18 years just by repayment, right? by paying one full year. On the journey of fast tracking the mortgage, we've also reduced the mortgage to 15 years and three months by paying 10% extra every month. So what is 10% extra every month? Our mortgage itself is 2,400, which is about the rent most people pay in this country. It's a little bit on the high side for us, obviously, because we are older, we are more matured. For younger people, the mortgage of a home like this could be about 1,200, which would be half of what we are currently paying. So in addition to that, we added another 10%, which is about 240 euros every month. So we pay in and around 2,640 every month, right? And I know the numbers because I'm tracking and tracing. Just by repeatedly doing that, we fast tracked our mortgage to 15 years and three months. If you're interested in seeing more videos like this, let me know. So I will be sharing videos on how we saved 150,000 euros. That's a lot of money, I can't even say it well. How we were able to do this whole process of mortgage in less than three months, right? It's crazy, but it was doable and we did it. Many other things, in addition to saving up for your mortgage, the additional cost that you surrounding purchasing your home, I'm, I can share that with you. Is age a barrier? I will be more than happy to share this with you as well. Because a lot of people tend to look at it like, oh, I'm too old, I'm, it's too late, etc. I told you, before, and I'll say it again, I'm, I'm in my 40, mid 40s, and my husband is in early 50s. It's never too late. I know someone emailed me from Amsterdam. Someone, a Nigerian person emailed me from Amsterdam to say that, oh, they are near 50 and their husband is in the early 50s. Is it too late? I'm telling you it's not too late. So if you want more videos like this, let me know and I'll share them. We're very intentional about where our money goes every month. If you want, I can also share a video on how I've been able to manage my own personal finances, how I'm managing our family finances. I'm the money person, right? My, my husband is the voice of reasoning. I'm the money person. So I tend to know where money goes to where money does not go to. Of course, while carrying him along, but I'm the one that tracks and trace. No, that is 500 euros. We can get it somewhere like 380 euros, if you know what I mean. So I'm the calculator person, I'm the math person, I'm the one looking like, the repayment for being is too high. 
let's look for another provider although the repayment for electricity is too high let's look for another provider i want to thank you so much for watching my video today if you're not subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for go ahead and click that subscribe button down below and don't forget to share this video with your friends you can share with your own brothers and sisters in the diaspora share with them let them watch let them learn and let them fulfill their potential it is possible for you to build wealth and it is possible to build wealth for your children and their own children all right this is god's promise every good person will leave an inheritance for their children don't chop alone leave some for your children and that's what we are trying to achieve all right so i want to thank you so very much for watching my video today i shall speak to you very 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 soon Bye-bye. <laughs>